square ACDE with same side AC and triangle ABC square BCGF with same side BC and triangle ABC make an isosceles triangle ABH same base AB and triangle ABC Connect DG. Then connect DH and GH. We get triangle DGH. Problem is. How to prove triangle DGH. Similar to triangle ABH. You can make a try to solve this problem. Maybe we can explore more from this problem. Let's extend AB. Through point E. Make a perpendicular segment EJ to AB. Through point F. Make a perpendicular segment FK to AB through point C. Make a perpendicular segment CM to AB Let's focus on right triangle EJA and right triangle AMC. Because EA equals to AC. Angle JE plus angle MAC is 90 degrees. So we can get right triangle EJA is congruent to right triangle AMC. So we will get AM equals to EJ. J equals to CM. Then let's focus on right triangle CMB. And FKB. Obviously, this two right triangle are also congruent. So we get MB equals to FK. BK equals to CM. We can get AM plus MB equals to EJ plus FK. AM plus MB is segment AB. From this equations, we get J equals to BK. Then, let's focus on point E, J, F, K, connect the F, 
So EJFK is a right trapezoid. Let's find the midpoint of segment AB. Label it as N. Then connect HN. Because triangle ABH is an isosceles right triangle. So we get HN equals to one half of AB. And HN perpendicular to AB. From this two equations, we can get HN equals to one half of EJ plus FK. Then we can get J plus N equals to NB plus BK. J plus N is segment JN. NB plus BK is segment NK. So point N is also the midpoint of JK. Meanwhile, HN perpendicular to JK and HN equals to one half of EJ plus FK. From the principle of median of trapezoid, we can deduce HN is the median of right trapezoid EJFK. So point E, H, F are collinear and EH equals to HF. Then, let's go ahead and extend segment DG through point E. Make a perpendicular segment EP to DG through point F. Make a perpendicular segment FQ to DG through point C. Make a perpendicular segment CR to DG. Obviously, right triangle PDE congruent to right triangle RCD. So we can get P equals to DR, PD equals to RC. Right triangle RGC also congruent to right triangle QFG. So we get. QF equals to RG. QG equals to RC.
we can get P plus QF equals to DR plus RG. equals to dg we can also conclude pd equals to qg let's focus on right trapezoid efqp EH equals to HF. Through point H. Make a perpendicular segment HT to PQ. HT is median of the right trapezoid. So HT equals to one half of P plus QF. From this two equations, HT equals one half of DG. Point T is the midpoint of PQ. PT equals to TQ. So PT minus PD equals to TQ minus QG. We can get DT equals to TG So point T is also the midpoint of DG. We get HT equals to DT equals to TG. Meanwhile, HT perpendicular to DG. This four angles are all equals to 45 degrees. We can conclude triangle DGH is also an isosceles triangle. We get the result. Triangle DGH. Similar to triangle ABH. Whatever the size of triangle ABC. Triangle DGH always similar to triangle ABH. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to thumbs up and click the subscribe button if you don't subscribe my channel now. You will not miss my future videos. 
See you next time.